Hello everyone, today I'm back with another TTM video, so let's get started. So, the first one took 10 days, and actually the person didn't sign any of the cards for me. But, what's really weird about this one, and I think he just forgot to sign them. Actually, it is from Mr. Ed Newman. So the cards I sent him. So usually when somebody sends your cards back, they don't answer your questions. And Mr. Newman answered my questions. Uh, I guess I can read them to you real quick here. Since he didn't sign my cards or he forgot to. So, who was the toughest defensive lineman you faced during your NFL career? He, his toughest uh, defensive lineman he faced was Joe Klecko from the New York Jets. Uh, which NFL stadium had the worst playing surface during your career? Dolphins artificial turf was pretty bad. And who was your favorite teammate on the Dolphins? Eric, uh, I think it's Latko. So I think he just forgot to sign the cards for me. I'll, that's okay. I'll send them back to him. So the next one took seven days and the person signed three of six for me. And that person would be former Texas Ranger, Mr. Bobby Witt. That turned out really nice. Flair Ultra. It's like this one right here. There's the Score 91 score, K-Man, that turned out nice. Oh, he also played for the A's, this one turned out really nice too. That's a 93 score, and these are the ones he didn't sign for me, which is okay. I can send them back to him in the future. So here's Mr. Bobby Witt's career stats. So, in the next one up, took 15 days, and the person signed three or three for me, and that person would be this out of the package here, or out of the envelope. I have my fancy card holder here, and it would be Mr. Garth. Org. Now, I got him to sign this uh, Toronto Blue Jays. It's a Midas Muffler card. Um, I have a Jim Acker signed in it, so we'll just send this one over here. Pretty cool. And he signed is, so it's an 81 Fleer, 82 Fleer. Look at the photography on those 82 Fleer. Amazing. And then he signed, what is it, the 85? Is this 85? Yep, 1985 tops. Looks really nice. And I'll show you Mr. Org's career stats here. Here they are. So, the next one. Took 18 days and the person signed five of five for me. <coughs> and that person would be Mr. Wilson Alvarez. Get my note out of the way here. There he is on his pro card. I really like these pro cards signed, but you got to be careful because a lot of them they must have took the pictures in, in the shade or something because you can't really see the players face or uniform in the picture and here he is on a 1993 scorecard it turned out really nice and the i thought this was pretty cool this is a studio i actually picked these up at a flea market uh i bought a big lot of cards and these were in it i have several of these uh, I got a John Olderoo that I want him to sign for me, but I thought these turned out really cool. What year is this studio? This is 95. I've actually never seen these cards before until I, I picked them up at the flea market. 
almost like looks like a credit card. Let's take this one right here. I, I don't really like that. Okay, stay up there, Bobby. And what is this? Is this a 95 upper deck? 94 upper deck. This one is. And what do we got here? Last but not least, the 93 Don Russ. It's former White Sox pitcher, Mr. Wilson Alvarez. And here's his stats for his career. So the next one only took seven days. And the person signed two or two for me, and that person would be <coughs> Mr. Billy Kilmer. Uh, should I say former Redskin Billy Kilmer? Kilmer. I want to call him Kilmore. It's Kilmer. There's a nice. Uh, what is this? This is a seventy-two tops. It turned out really nice. Let's set this one right here. And here's a upper deck. This one, I was surprised about this one here because I didn't know whether this would show up, uh, the autograph on the card, but it turned out really nice. There he is with the Saints. Let's set this one down right here. And Mr. Kilmer's career stats. So... Last but not least, this one took seven days, and the person signed 404 for me, and that person would be, get them out of here. Let me get these straightened out here. These are from former Pittsburgh Steeler, Mr. Merrill Hodge. Now, he was pretty elusive for me. Uh, this is the third time I sent to him, and I finally got a return. So, there he is on a 91 Pro Set. Let's see if we can set this right here. It's a 92 Skybox. Yep, 1992 Skybox. Set this one right there. And there's a 90 Fleer. And last but not least, I have him on a 1991 Upper Deck. We'll set this one over here. And I'll show you his career stats. There it is. So that's all I have for today, folks. I want to thank Mr. Merrill Hodge. Mr. Billy Kilmer, Mr. Wilson Alvarez, Mr. Bobby Witt, and Mr. Garth Org for signing these cards and getting them back to me. I want to thank you guys for watching. Just remember, keep collecting, keep searching for those hidden gems, and keep having fun. Later.